reacting to Creecraft's video on the downfall of Pet Sim 99. Oh, I don't have it on. What? Someone burned this. I, I talked about this, but like now I get to see it. Imagine doing this. All right. Pretend. Uh, whatever. Pretend like it's on fire. Imagine. Who would do that? Spend thirty, forty dollars on a plushie just to burn it. Oh man. Wow. I'm not confused, but I just want to react to this to see if he's 100% correct because I know the truth. That's actually very true. And I have a suggestion for Pet Sim 99 that they should really do. This is what they should do. They should go ahead and just like, so they do a tiny update every week and then the big one comes. So they will do a tiny one. Maybe adding like two area, three, four, ten areas. Maybe like adding some new game passes, pets, exclusive eggs, all that. And then they have that one big update. Yeah, so like I have a clan, I'll show you real quick. I have a clan. It's not big, it's small. But like, I wanna become number one, all right? I wanna beat the boss clan. I wanna beat the group. I wanna beat the cat, hippo male, all those clans. So as you can see right here, I got a clan. This guy is my biggest donator, actually second biggest, 200,000. <laughs> Never kicking you from the party. So yeah, if you want to join, put your username down below, and I will invite you to my clan, and you can join. I, and you'll be shouted out in some of my videos. Oh, I need to. Let's see. Goodbye to Petsim ninety nine. Here we go. Oh really? Wait, I didn't know that. I didn't know that. My clan doesn't use that. Wait, really? Oh, loop again exposed. Oh. I want to punch big games right now. I just want to go ahead. That's the way to fix my anger. They wrote, they gave hackers, they gave hackers Titanic. Oh, you're ridiculous. They hacked the game, they ruined the game. And they just give, oh yeah. Oh, you ruined the game? Oh, here's a Titanic. <laughs> oh God, that's exposing my room. I'm doing a room tour someday. 1,000 subscribers and then you'll see my room probably. Yeah, we should do that. Yeah, we should definitely be doing that. We should be giving some exploiters, people who break the game, some free Titanics. And, and let me show you what I'm talking about. 
if we join Pet Simulator 99 over here. Just let it load, let it load. So you can see this, this check the chest. So I got a spin ticket. Um, nothing, I knew it already. No. Alright, so this. They exploited the everything out of it. And they're just like, oh yeah, we, we confessed. Because the main reason why they confessed to it was because they just said, they just wanted the money. But they got Titanics! If you look at my inventory right now, I don't have a Titanic. Titanic anywhere? No Titanic! <laughs> yeah, that's angering me. Look. History? Any Titanics here? Can, can, can anyone tell me a Titanic there? Never had one in my life. My grandma joined me. Also, can you guys please send my grandma a huge in her mailbox? It, it can be any huge. She doesn't even care. She really wants a huge. So, like, and I, 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 I'm trying to get her one, but maybe you guys could. I just want to surprise her, like, oh, wow, you got a huge for free from someone. So, yeah. So, they did exploit that really bad. Let's see what he's going to say. This is what you guys probably know, so I'll skip over a little bit. Okay, right there. The Neon Agony, bro! I... tell you about because I, I, I know so like it's like they're trying to get the hackers to hack in their game to find an exploit so they can fix the exploit and they pay them for that but they didn't do it for that they didn't pets and big games oh yeah I'm so mad I'm so mad I'm gonna destroy my life my voice face cam is going to be destroyed. And my flash oh, oh, oh. Did we skip the back? That's fine. I can put that back up there. But imagine doing that though. <laughs> Like the trading plaza. Like he's talking about the trading plaza where you trade and someone's like, oh, do you want this Titanic pet? Oh, yeah, I'll take your 15 huges. Thank you very much. And now you have a Titanic and you lost 15 huges. That's how it works. Let's keep talking. And this is 
Thousand how you spent like a hundred yet? But I'm upset! Big games, what? Smart idea! Smart idea! They were just given the rare pets. The hackers have said in various DMs that they would much prefer money, but the developers didn't offer them money, instead, they just gave them the rarest pets in the game. And now people are upset over it. So upset. That some people have started hacking the game in response, <laughs> literally promoting Roblox hacks. Just yeah, she got banned. Well, those hackers got some free pets. Maybe if I hack the game, I'll get some free pets too. It's actually kind of wild. But the situation gets crazier because big games responded to the drop. Right oh, I love this part. Josh, uh, I heard of it. He's the community manager. He tweeted out, he said, so much negativity in the Pet Slitter 99 community. I think the majority of it stemmed from the clan situation. Time to introduce some positivity. And then Pizza King here said, delete the rainbow shiny titanics that you gave the exploiters who abused the glitch and got 20,000 images for free that they still have. That will improve the game. And then he replied, boring topic next. Why? That's one of the worst things I ever heard of developers say. First, press to say, why are free to place the most thing or something? And that was that? Bro, if I was Preston seeing my uh, worker doing that, boom, I'll be doing that. You see my plushie right here? That's what would be happening. Get fired! I'm not trying to be rude or anything to Coilist or stuff. He's a really nice guy. I watch his videos and stuff. He, he runs the big games channel and stuff. But, like, he should be fired for saying that. Preston shouldn't have said that thing that back into Petsu X. But, like, I, I shouldn't be talking about X because it's a 99. I wasn't even playing during X. I just was bored, and so I looked at a dead game video. Topic next. So, like, you're not supposed to do that as a dev. You shouldn't be just going around and saying, boring topic next. Like, imagine I was at my YouTube channel, and this guy said, you know what, I feel like the way to boost your channel is to start doing this and this and this and this and this and etc. And then I say, boring topic next. Mm -mm, I'm never saying that to my fans. Boring topic next. That's, That's ridiculous. This person could have replied with. What they could have said instead is something like, hey, we understand your concern. This is what we did. Here is why we did it. Hopefully that makes sense. We'll try and do better going forward into the future. That's all he had to say. That's it. That would have solved the situation. But he said boring topic next. Weren't happy at all, just like me. Coilus, just like, you need to, the big games community, de I mean like dev team, definitely needs some working with speaking to the community, helping the community out when they need it, making them happy, responding without boring topic next. Yeah, it's the truth. He's like 17, probably. He's probably like 17. Alright, you shouldn't be blocking people who are helping you. This is what the devs are like. 
Oh, you're trying to give us recommendations? Banned and blocked. I wouldn't be doing that because the community wants something. You don't do that, all right, big games? I'm not trying to be rude or anything. I love big games. Don't ban me, please, big games. and I get expelled from school. Oh, back to the plushie. Their plushies. <laughs> Give me one second. I'll That's my dad. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and that's the truth. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Goodbye.